Hmm, the big burger that you ordered has been delivered to you. You smell it before taking the first bite, but this delicious dish has some horrible consequences, and you know it. We call it fart, flatulence, wind or gas, and you will expel it before you finish having dinner. Once we put the food in our mouth, a new trip starts. When it arrives to our guts, we start producing gases, and it's a matter of time before we expel them. But they can also stay stuck in your guts, causing a horrible bellyache. We can classify them depending on their wish of getting out of the body. The backdoor trumpet, the one that even scares you when you hear it. The artist, the one that comes with the present and leaves a stain. The backpacker, the betrayer, the one that follows you everywhere and everyone finds out. The whispering, the one that comes out like a breeze. The mute or ninja fart. It's silent, but it's not nice at all. It can easily kill anybody. The firebug is similar. It can burn anything. Mexican food is its best friend. These are the main types of farts, but they can change depending on food and people. They can be caused by the intake of farewell we eat, by the composition of the food, or even by our own body, because it could mix the stomach acids with the intestine bicarbonate. Gases are formed by nitrogen, hydrogen and carbon dioxide, methane and oxygen. They also have little excrement particles, but they're very little. Gases have more nitrogen in their composition than methane, but most of them are flammable. That's why we can make the phenomenon of the fart and the lighter. We just have to light the lighter when we're going to fart. This will make a big flame. Don't do it at home, kids. The fart smell is caused when some different kind of gases are mixed with the hydrogen sulfate and the ammonia in the intestine. This both give our farts a sulfur smell. Sometimes some farts don't smell like anything. This happens because the gas composition is more simple. The fart sound is also very important. Some of them are silent, but others are noisy. The explanation is very simple. The noise is caused by the friction of the walls of the rectum when the air comes out. The noise is even stronger when the farts meets the buttocks. Each culture thinks something different about farts. In some cultures it's good to fart in public, but in some others you can be judged by the people that surround you. Just in case, try not to fart in first date. And in the second one. Sometimes a big quantity of gas can be a sign of health problems, especially when it can't be controlled and you can't lead a normal life. Nutrition is also a very important factor. For example, fries, legumes, some vegetables like cauliflower and lactose can cause more gases. If you have this kind of problem, don't worry. You should know that an average person farts at least 10 times per day but it's said that people who live in the high places fart more. Farts make no gender distinction, so everyone can fart. As Shrek said, better out than in, Fiona. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. And write in the comment section down below if you know more kinds of farts. See you next time.